Assalamu alaikum. Good morning. We are going to continue with our English language lesson. With me, your English language teacher, Miss Anis. But today, we are going to insert civic element in our English language lesson, making it as civic education. Let's recite the du'a first. Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Oh Allah, the most gracious, the most merciful, is our learning, bless our knowledge, may the success be in our life. Amin. So, the focus skill today is writing skill. At the end of the lesson, you should be able to fill in at least three blanks correctly. So, the civic literacy, knowledge. You should be able to describe the importance of abiding road traffic laws. Social emotional. Be aware of road traffic laws. Action. You should abide the traffic laws. So the value for this month, February, is mutual respect. And the context is society. The topic is road safety. Before we uh, continue with our lesson, let's watch the video. Ping pong! Hokey hokey! Hokey channel! Hokey hokey! Hokey's got a new channel! Ta da! Check out my channel! Hokey! Bus. When you get on the bus, always use the handrail and do not push your friends. Put, put, put your seatbelt on. Keep your head and hands inside at all times. Always be safe. Always use the handrail. Put your seatbelt on. Keep your head and hands inside at all times. Okay, I'm going to stop here. Because you, I think you already have some knowledge on our topic today, which is the road safety. So as an introduction, traffic laws are created to ensure the safety of pedestrians and motorists. Pedestrians means people walking on the road or streets. It is the responsibility of all road users to know the road signs and abide by the traffic laws Failure to abide by the traffic laws may result in accidents that can cause serious injuries or death. Road users will feel safe if traffic laws are obeyed. So the focus for today is traffic laws to ensure safety. And it is our responsibility to know the road signs and to abide by the traffic laws because we want to prevent accidents which can cause serious injuries or death. Okay, let's look at uh, some of the signs, road signs. No entry, pedestrian, traffic light, hump, stop slow signs. Okay, uh, we are going to watch another video. Hello friends, today we will learn about road safety. I'll help you learn about this. Road safety is the protection and prevention of road accidents by using all the road safety measures. Look closely. It's very important to know the traffic signals. Red means stop. When the signal turns red, all the vehicles have to stop. Green means go. Only when the signal turns green, vehicles move ahead. Yellow means to slow down. When the signal turns yellow, vehicles should slow down. And now, Let's study about the traffic light signals for pedestrians. 
Red man, do not cross. If you see the red man, it means you should not walk. Green man, safe to cross the intersection. Yes, you can walk now. Now see these signs. They're the traffic warning signs. The warning traffic signs are triangular and have a red border and white background. Normally, a drawing in black indicates the danger. And these are called the traffic forbidden signs. Prohibition signs are round with the red border having white background. They have a picture in the center in black with which is prohibited. Now let's see some road safety tips we should always follow. Look both ways while crossing a street. Never cross if vehicles are coming. Use the zebra crossing only when you see the vehicles are stopped and walking man signal is green. Wear a helmet when riding a two-wheeler. It protects us from injury. Be conscious of driving and always when moving on a sidewalk. Always wear a seat belt while in the car. It helps against harmful movement like a sudden brake. When getting fuel for car, always turn the engine off or it may catch fire. Do not use matchstick or lighter while in any vehicle. This may be dangerous. Always follow the correct speed for the car. Don't drive too fast. Okay, we are going to stop here. Okay, the civic information, or more towards the value today, uh, the right. I have the right to use roads safely, means we have the right to use the roads safely. And it is our responsibility to abide or to follow the road traffic laws. So, for your task today, first, you need to copy down the questions and fill in the blanks. You can find the answers from the video just now. So if you wish to listen to the video again, you can play this uh, recording again and you can actually fill in the blanks by listening to it again. Okay, we have one, two, three and four questions. Just listen and you can always refer to the um, visual aids or pictures provided here. Okay, I think we shall call it a day. That's all from me. Don't forget to take a snapshot of your task, completed task, and send it to me. Thank you. Bye.